Pirates have been a part of popular culture ever since they first appeared on the high seas. The tales of Long John Silver, Captain Hook, and Jack Sparrow are as popular now as they've ever been. But are these depictions of pirates real? Was there really an X on the map, buried treasure, and a black flag with a skull? Did duels to the death really take place between naval authorities and these wild men of the seas? It turns out, yes. This is the story of Le Mahong, the boldest pirate of the Far East who lived during the latter half of the 16th century. With a price set on his head by different emperors of China for the high crimes he committed against his people and merchants from various countries, he sailed away to establish a new kingdom. At length, pursued in all directions by the imperial ships of war, he determined to attempt the Philippines' conquest, a new X on his map. Lim Hong and his army of about 3,000 Chinese warriors first arrived in Locos Sur in early 1574. After struggling with the Spanish army under the command of Juan de Salcedo, his troops were driven away from the city. The pirates then chanced upon merchant ships and learned that Manila was a new and relatively unprotected Spanish settlement. Limahong's fleet landed in Manila on November 29, 1574. He mobilized 700 of his men and began their march toward Intramuros, the seat of Spanish power. They were able to kill the Spanish master of camp, Martin de Goiti, but the battle caused them delays, giving the Spanish forces time to reorganize. Days passed, losing men after men. At last, Limahong retreated, but not before they could burn the San Agustin church. Limahong set sail north and settled in Pagasinan near Agno River's mouth and built his fort. In Manila, plans were made to capture Limahong, and Salcedo's fleet set sail on March 23, 1575. Salcedo blockaded the Agno River, caught sight of the Chinese vessels, and ordered them burned. The Chinese were able to regroup, and a long four month siege ensued. Limahong still held out, but perceiving that an irresistible onslaught was coming for him, he escaped into the China Sea toward his former lair, reaching the island of Tikaltikan where he had sought refuge and later died. A lot of what is known about pirates is not true, and a lot of what is true is not known. But this is the story of Limahong, a real-life pirate who marked the Philippines as an X on his map but failed to acquire its treasure.